This is a play I wrote for one of my creative writing classes. The name of this play is Love in the Night. It's only one scene and one act, but I might add more to it eventually. Lily sits at a vanity table in her bedroom. Behind her is an open window. I am done waiting around for Johnny. She opens her vanity table, retrieves a sleep mask, and slams the drawer shut. She goes to bed and covers her eyes with the sleep mask. Outside the window, the small black horns of a demon begin to rise up. Caliban, a male demon, peeks over the window ledge and watches as Lily drifts off to sleep. Oh, how elegant Lily is when she sleeps. For all these months I have been watching her, this is the first time I have heard her mention her dear lover Johnny in such a negative fashion. How long I have been waiting for this night to arrive. Human relationships of the earth never last. It was only fate that Johnny would break her heart eventually. Luck would have it tonight. Caliban climbs through the window. How I would love to sit next to her and breathe in the clean scent of her fresh soul. I mustn't wake her though. Caliban crosses the room towards the sleeping Lily. He warily seats himself at the foot of her bed. My dear Lily, how long I have been waiting for this moment. Lily is woken by the sound of her name. She screams. Who in the hell are you? Caliban, startled, gets up quickly. His tail knocks perfume bottles off the vanity and they smash. Lily gapes at his tail. What in the hell are you is a better question. My sweet angel, we are not in hell. Not yet, at least. Please don't fret. I mean you no harm, my child. What on earth are you talking about? Yes, earth is where we are, Lily. Now that you have your sense of location back, our conversation should flow more smoothly. I know you are usually quite disoriented when you are sleepy. Lily trembles. How do you know my name? Oh, dear Lily, please don't be afraid. He steps closer to her and gently reaches out his hand, claws protruding. Lily jumps out of her bed and screams. Don't come near me, I'm warning you. Caliban, startled, jumps back. His tail knocks a picture of Lily and Johnny off the va vanity and the glass smashes. My dear, I am ever sorry. Please do not be afraid of me. I swear on Lucifer that I mean you no harm. Who are you and what do you want from me? My dear Lily, I am Caliban, Prince of Night. I was sent to be in possession of your soul, but I have fallen in love with you, watching you weep at night in your bed and wait for a lover who never shows. I know up until now, you have been so forgiving of Johnny, but tonight I was made aware by your words that your waiting for him has come to an end. Is my perception of this true? How long have you been watching me for? 389 days, 11 hours, and 38 seconds. I have informed Hell that I have gained full possession of your soul by telling them this lie my time on Earth is being extended. They believe I am accomplishing great and evil things up here. However, Lily, my only desire on this Earth is to watch you at night. In all my thousands of years, I have never encountered a soul as pure as yours. Lily faints. Caliban catches her before she falls to the floor. The confession of my love soothes your soul into a sound sleep as she stood. He cradles her in his arms and looks down at her face. Now, my love, we have a wedding to plan. They exit the stage. And that's the end. I think I might add more to it because I think it's actually really good. Thank you for watching.